Yo, welcome to the eighth episode of Seraphic Blue. It's been a while since I last played, but here we are. We just started going into this uh, little small dungeon area. I am actually do not have a rough idea of where to go. Well, how to navigate through this dungeon. I know we have to get the... What is it going to call it? Detox. Uh, detoxins or something like that? To clear out our way, but I kind of forgot uh, how far we got into this area. I even forgot these guys' uh, resistances. I believe fire. Yeah, fireworks. Fireworks. Alright, let's go. Oh, she. I just fucking remember now. Yeah, it's all coming back to me. I fucking remember now. I needed to replenish my uh, supply. Alright, time to see how much uh, we get from this. Because I actually don't remember. Wow, that was a lot, actually. From one, and we have like 20 spheres. Uh, okay. I guess buying all that many was kind of a waste, wasn't it? Well, eh. Who knows? I might get some good use out of them in the future. I can do something about uh, our speed. Kind of wish we were a bit faster than that. All right. This came through this way. I'm just gonna follow wherever I see like a spilled barrel. this way and then down south and okay all right then it's just getting bullied Roughly where we left off last time, I believe so. Come on. Is it just me, or is there more enemies than the usual? I feel like there weren't all of this is these many enemies in the last episode. There was a serpent, but like, I don't ever recall like getting bombarded with like four enemies. Back to back. Oh, 
How did I get? I bet it wasn't even anything special. Ah, oh, yes, I forgot. I did not read the manual yet. God damn it, I really need to do that. Uh, remove all negative statuses from one ally. That's actually pretty good. I want. Uh, I can't remember if it was possible to get, like, status by multiple things at once. That sound effect makes me think it's a crit, but it's not really a crit, is it? enjoying myself not getting a random encounter because I really don't want to waste uh, a lot of TP. I wonder if there's gonna be... Actually, now thinking about it, they should have that little... I forgot what was that. Uh, flower called that teleports you at the start of the dungeon. I shouldn't be worrying about uh, my supply in this thing. I should be fine. Uh... on the second enemy and then just uh, have one of my players just like heavy attack I guess characters whatever uh, let's see nice very nice more enemies paralysis all right that's gonna be fun oh god Okay, so it is possible to get multi status. Fun. Are you kidding me? There was an item back there now that I recall. Surprise attack. Oh god. I thought we got the surprise shit. Paralysis. Freeze. Oh god. Here. This could at least take care of the devil. And then. Fire attack, I should kill Yeah, we can. I thought these were the enemies that can, like, take three fire attacks to kill Let's go get that one item. I guess while exploring around, I can talk about some other stuff to keep things a little bit more interesting. Uh, I kind of want to make a response, well not really a response, but more of a, like, my thoughts on PSO 2 in Genesis, because I saw the, uh, the little, what's it call it, news broadcast they do, like, every month. It was something new. But, like, honestly, I'm not, I don't have high hopes for it. It's just Alio, but in the desert. Gonna be 100% honest with you. The content we're probably gonna get is just copy and paste. 
from what we got from Alio. Sure, we're gonna have new skills and stuff, and I'm, I don't know if I'll say I'm excited for new skills, because, like, I doubt it'll be anything that great. I can go, like, on a huge rant over uh, PSO2 New Genesis. I really could. And sometimes I feel like I really should, but, like, uh, I don't know. Seems like a lot of work, and I'm not the kind of guy who likes reading off of the script, honestly. I, I usually don't find that to be very entertaining. I don't know, there's just something so, like, interesting and fun about, like, videos without a script or anything. Like, I can understand things like, we're backtracking, son of a bitch. I can understand, like, having, like, a list of topics to talk about to keep yourself in track, but, like, I don't know, man. Unless it's, like, a very informative video. But, like, actually, I don't know. I did my tutorial videos without a script, just a little guide going. I don't know. Scripts aren't for me, honestly. I'm just, like, too lazy for a script. And I don't want to sound, like, very fucking robotic when reading off a script. That's just dumb. Shit, we're running low anyway. We're gonna have to fucking backtrack. God damn it. Fuck me. This was what I was afraid of. Ugh. Oh man, I wish there was a way I can like bypass these encounters. People are actually dying. Shit. Oh. God damn, dude. Do we at least have enough TP? In our supply? Ah, uh, we do. Alright, that's good, but run, we're running low on that too. Uh, who has healing again? I don't think anybody has healing. Okay, you have healing. Vena is lacking HP. Ah, oh, damn it. I don't know, man. I can rant about PSO2 all fucking day. I think the base game is good. Kinda. Like, it is good, but like... It's just that you don't have enough players to start trigger quests. And plus, uh, Kratos kinda ruined it. Because it made it way too easy to get, like... Uh, just X cubes, turn them into grinders. Uh, augments, pretty fucking easy. Like, if you're trying to make, like, God affixes, you can get everything you need to make Guardian Uh, hold on. Let me focus on what I'm trying to do. You can get, like, everything you need to make Guardian install from Cradle. It's dumb. It's really dumb. There's very little incentive to go back and do stuff like maybe Luther? Am I going the right way? Yeah, I am going the right way. Uh, wait a minute. Yeah, okay. It was this. There's very inc little incentive to go back and do, like, uh, I wouldn't say old, old content, but, like, at least any other ultra hard content. I mean, yes, S Hogments are very useful. Um, they got rare camos, too, that look. Pretty cool, but like, you can't really reliably do that on your own. You can't just solo an ultra hard. It's not skill, it's scaled for 12 players to complete. And that's one thing I'll give New Genesis. They made it so urgent quest scales 
based on the number of players you have. Though I, I don't think it's possible to fucking solo the mining defense because there's just too many enemies, too many uh, moments where you're just running back and forth. Let's do another one, so we can just get max uh, HP, and plus I have a fuck ton of these, so wouldn't hurt. Wouldn't hurt at all. <laughs> First step, god damn it. Uh, there's no runaway option either, that's annoying. Sometimes I just don't want to waste my supply, dude. Forget. Ah, dude, they just inflicted me with a bunch of bullshit. Ah. Forget, really? Come on. Maybe I can, like, try something? I don't know. What? They didn't even kill the jellyfishes. God damn it. Anyhow, what was I talking about? Oh yeah, mining defense. Uh, I hate mining defense. I think I said it before, but like, I I really hate mining defense. Yeah, I definitely said it during my Boulder Force playthrough. Uh, but it's just dumb. I hate, I hate having to run around, and I hate having to like, kind of aggro everything on site and that's kind of hard thing to do when you're just using knuckles only and i know some folks are like oh you shouldn't be using knuckles only it gets the job done i always do the mo i don't want to say the most amount of damage because it depends on what content we're doing but for most of the content i really do do the most amount of damage Maybe not in like, um, what's it gonna call it? Uh, Sodam? I can't really, okay, the first phase, yeah, I can do the most amount of damage. Second phase, uh, not really, unless everyone is just like, <laughs> playing a class that doesn't do a whole lot of damage, or like, just not skillful enough. I don't know, is that a bad thing to say? Really? I don't know, I'm just being honest. Oh, oh. Alright. I don't know, it's just a pain in the ass to try to get the aggro from the enemies. When you have like a weapon that isn't really meant for range. Ah, uh, serpent. Who's attacking? Nixon. Alright, this should be fine. Paralysis. Ah, cool. I love it. Off to an amazing start.
I don't know, man. I'm just not that excited for the upcoming desert uh, update. I'll play a day one, and I'll put in like a bunch of. Oh, I, I'm not actually entirely sure. Hold up, next week is the fifth. Uh, I might or might not be busy that day, but I'll try to play it. Uh, a good amount of it, I'll try. But like, I don't know, man. Let's just. Uh, I'd rather play this game or Shimmy Gum Intensive 5 instead. I don't know, man. I just really hate New Genesis. I don't even do dailies anymore. I don't even log in anymore. I only, like, do the base uh, PSO2 stuff. Like, whenever our, I'm bored, which is not a recent thing, to be honest. I only really do week, the weekly divide stuff with my friend. But I kind of rarely go on it now, even on base PSO2. Just because I've been busy and because there isn't really much to do. Really. Where? What? Oh, forget. Ah, uh, god damn it. Ah, uh, this is dumb. This whole fucking random sh stuff is dumb, dude. Ah, oh, I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. This game, dude. Random encounters are so just like annoying. Wait, wait, this is blind. Ah, huh? oh, dude. I don't want to use our herbal drink for this. God damn it. This is so dumb. You're targeting you. You. Venom, please kill them. Kill them all. <laughs> Lake is paralyzed. Dude! That's so dumb. So fucking lame. Oh my god. Oh, this is dumb. This. God damn it. Not a whole lot of action going on this episode. Well, because these goddamn fucking random encounters. Ah! Uh, that was very funny. I would say one thing though. I think. Oh, actually, nah. I wouldn't say it now. I need more time with this game. I need more time with it. I was gonna say. Maybe the random encounters in this game are harder than Shimigami Tensei 5 encou random encounters. Very bold thing to say. But I think I need more time in this game before I make that true. Uh, these enemies are indeed dangerous. Because they can status you and they can do a lot of damage. And they can outspeed you. Holy shit. That's. Whenever an enemy can outspeed you in an RPG, you know that's <laughs> that's you're gonna have a bad time. Being outsped is not fun. Okay, fine, it, it's a little fun, but <laughs> have we gotten that item yet? I feel like I was trying to get an item over here, but mm, damn it! Fuck it, I don't want any items. I just want to reach the end already, please. I don't want this episode to be entirely of me just exploring around in this fucking hellish random encounter dungeon. Oh, dude.
Oh yeah, that is true. I got um, what is it called, like Fania? I think I got like enough to use. Okay, never mind. I do not have enough of them. I was thinking, it's like, oh, like, I keep getting them from drops. Maybe I can use them once after my supply man runs out. And I should be fine. Nah, I feel like I'll need them for boss fights. That's that's what I wanted. That's all I wanted. Not to be outsped and not to waste uh, t TP carelessly. Okay. Well, I feel like I might regret that. I feel like there might be like a barrel I can. God damn it! Like a barrel down here that leads to like a secret item plus another. Duh. What is it called? Deep Toxin? I am actually legit sick of these random encounters. Oh my god. At least we should be close. I think we're reaching the near end. Like, oh, those two barrels? Yeah, definitely. I could have just strong attack. What am I fucking doing? Wasting TP like this. Have 17 left. Do not get a random encounter, please. Thank you. Alright, we got the item I was looking for. What the fuck? Okay, never mind. Probably. Cause I thought uh, they already did all their four actions, but hmm. all right. Finally, we have reached the end. Please tell me there's like one of those um, teleporting plants. Thank you. Oh God, thank you, man. I that was just rough, dude. That was really rough. Actually, now think about it, since we're reaching the near end of this dungeon, what's the point of going for a supply mint when I can just go to the hotel after this is all over? Eh. <laughs> I don't know. Who cares? Let's just get this over with. And, uh, get your ass over here. This dungeon sucks, dude. I hate it. <laughs> Too many random encounters. Alright. Finally! So, what do you think of this display of the sea at night? Do you enjoy it? Too many random encounters, bro. Yeah, sure. You put up <laughs> one hell of a show. Alright. I have to thank you for that. That's good to hear. I'm delighted. Hey, Ender. Let me just ask you some questions, even though I doubt you'll answer. Who the hell are you? How do you know Venner? And why do you treat me as your enemy? Can I respond? Nope, <laughs> I don't. After all, I have superiority over you guys in that I know everything, while you know nothing at all. 
Now why would I want to give up such a delightful thing so easily? I'll be sure to suck every single drop of enjoyment out of you. I'll drain it away until you're all withered. In the meantime, go ahead and drool over my superior, my superior about position. It's no less than your kind deserves. <laughs> Holy shit, Ende. <laughs> Ende, I can't believe you would say something like that. Yeah, I had enough of him. This bastard's twisted to the core. Don't be so angry now. I think I haven't revealed my last trick for the night, you know. Last trick? You mean, the one like before? Bingo. Wouldn't it, wouldn't it, after all, be a fitting conclusion? I need some water, dude. What the freaking hell is that thing? I told you already, didn't I? I won't give you any answers to that kind of question. If you want to know so badly, why don't you ask Vene? Oh yeah, I forgot. She won't know anything even if you ask her now, will she? Meh. What a useless woman. I'm definitely gonna kill you, you bastard. This child is seriously short on compassion. He ought to be punished by the Lord. Huh, don't take me so lightly. Here shall unfold the summon of the practitioner. Thou who art a disciple of destruction, the one who forged a path of demise upon all heartless, was that? What? I didn't get to read the last part. Great. I didn't fucking finish reading. Orc thug. Huh. What in the world is this ill feeling? Unbelievable, isn't it? This ain't no ordinary monster. It ain't even close to a devil. Which is why I want to know just what the hell this monster is. Orkthug is the name of this beast. He shall be the one to conclude the night. Well, I doubt there will be any way you guys will die here. Wait, what? I doubt there's any way you guys will die here. But in any case, good luck. I like this. This is really cool. Or the little, I was reading the katakana, man. Wait. Enemy data. Ooh, that's kind of a lot. Wait, he has TP. I just didn't even. I didn't have. That didn't click with me. With the other enemies. I wonder if, like. Once he's out, would he just do regular things, or does all your shit cause zero TP? He uses water. Ah, oh, should have been more prepared. Ah, oh, we're gonna die! I forgot about the spheres, dude. Shit. Whatever. I think we should be fine. Maybe. What does your stuff do? Transfers half a minute. Okay, that's not that useful right now. Oh god, Vin is her only healer. Is this, uh... is this new? Yeah, only she's a strong negative energy ripple. Blind all enemies. Well, he resists blind just fully, so that's not gonna be much. But how much damage is that? Hold on. I need to test something with Wade. How much damage you get off of that? 500? And you should get like normal speed. A regular attack would probably be like 250 ish. Alright. 400 actually. Huh. Interesting. Ooh, that's a lot of damage. Oh, we don't have heal. Vin is the only one of healing. Honestly, what I could have done better with this 
fight with. Actually, have Lake with heals, and then like everyone just use their fire move, firely. Yeah. I actually, maybe. Okay. I was hoping maybe there was an off chance that I might have gave him heal, but no. Of course not. Kind of slow too, so I shouldn't be shouldn't be that much of a problem. Then again, we don't have ag we don't have like anything to AOE heal us, so that might actually come to bite us in the ass. Why Two hundred? That's not too bad. But I think I'm gonna heal just in case. Looking at this monster, you just, what the fuck? What is that? Like on top of his head? Is that like a, another mouth or? Huh. It kind of looks like a toe now. Not gonna lie. Oh, that's disgusting, dude. <laughs> oh man, that's actually disgusting. <laughs> All right. How much HP you got? 3k, so we're close. Alright, wasn't that big of a deal not being fully uh, prepped up. But, or maybe, I actually don't even know what equipment I have on right now with me. But, we're good, we're good. This is no big deal. Honestly, the random encounters were a bigger problem than this. I'm not gonna lie. I felt like those random encounters would really fuck me over if I get status. Ooh, 400 basically. Ooh, oh my god. Kill Nixon. Uh, if, he, if he's gonna throw out 400s, maybe I need to start healing. Top everyone's health off. Was that it? No way. What's going on? I actually don't remember, bro. Don't tell me there's the second phase. That's it, right? That's it. All right, cool. Nice, we did it. Nice. Phew. That was a tough one. At any rate, it appears we are now faced with a problem. First of all, there is that grotesque monster with unknown origin and an overwhelmingly sinister aura about it. But more importantly than that is that mysterious boy going by the name Ende. Who was responsible for summoning that monster? This is so frustrating. There's no doubt that my heart recognizes the terrifying aura of that thing Ende summoned. And I can still feel it now, but I can't quite make out what that is. Nothing else is related to it comes to mind either. There's just no way I can recall anything. No, there is definitely a way. Let us head back to the end and recharge ourselves for tomorrow. It has, after all, been a long... Uh, night? Did he say night? I have no idea. The scenery, it certainly brings back memories, doesn't it? Brings back memories? Hmm, that's funny. To think I, the outsider, am able to see what you, the person uh, concerned, have yet to grasp. Don't you remember the place where you showed your own true will that opposed mine? Are you referring to the final place of I didn't finish thanks auto text now you remember that certainly is the one and only proof of instance of who you truly are yet behind the scenes you seem to have placed your faith in Vene 
Well, I would have advised you to stop wasting your efforts. She'll never live up to you. She has neither the determination nor the compatibility to do that. Then I will surely be able to do it. Nah, she'll at most resist once. Even if Fritz pushes her forward, that's as far as she'll go. Fritz. Huh. Are you saying she can go further? The persona that she wears now is certainly ingenuine, but if she can discover the multiple truths lying underneath the persona, it is possible for the persona to become the self. How oh, foolish. Let me correct that line of thinking for you at once. Any attempt to alter the inedible fate will only falter. That resistance is the perfect example. In the end, nothing came out of it. It'll only be a thought and defeat. Uh, or, it'll only be through defeat for Venom and for her friends. No, you're wrong. How so? That will only be a partial defeat for Sigberg. Hmm, I seriously don't get whatever the hell you're saying. What you just said is only a prediction, <laughs> not an outcome. Both Vene and Lake will never be able to overturn reality. That is the destined outcome. That, I auto text, cool. Just sit back and watch. If you don't believe me, ultimately nothing will change. Yes, all of you will soon realize that you won't have a long future ahead of you. Whatever happens during her amnesia, all of the persona will see is nothing more than an empty dream. I hope you all look forward to savoring the delicacy of despair in hell. Vene, do not forget. This is your future. Alright. Let's head to White Wings. Ships going there should be back in service today. Alright. I think I'm going to save it. Uh, and then end the episode here. Alright, till next time.